Yo, that game was an absolute madness. If you're a Manchester United fan, that was my team. And my team's been through some fuckery. That was my team. I'd be raging. Raging. Like, where do you even start? It's 3 2. The game is done. The game's done. It's the last minute of added time. That could be debatable. Was it eight minutes? Some of the penalties, maybe the first. Both penalties could be debatable. Both teams were doing their madness. I knew the game would be open, but some of them are oh, awful. Chelsea up 2 0. May not have been momentum because that mistake that's always in Chelsea. Come back 2 2. Second half, may not have doing their thing. 3 2. There were some good goals, by the way. And you're thinking, the game's done. You're thinking, boy, pressure's swinging back to Poch. The pressure was swinging on both ways on managers. The two managers of top teams who's under pressure this season. You can't make this shit up. I can't believe what I saw. I thought, I thought the Newcastle West Ham result was crazy. This is wild. Chelsea fans were ready to be pissed. Nobody still pissed with certain angles of the game. I thought May United had this, the governor spirit to come back. And then the penalty is given in the last minute of added time. And 3-3, free, free, that's criminal. Come back 3-3, free, free, you're thinking, you know what? After the game, we can talk about it, be pissed. To, to let that happen in the last dying seconds of injury time, to make it 3-3. Free, free. Let alone, was it less than about a minute later, that guy Cole Palmer, Cole Palmer, he's cold. 4-3. That is rage. That is rage. Talk about the penalties. People are going to put it on, I've heard people already, 10 hog, 10 hog. I'm sorry. Everyone's got their own opinions. That ain't, that ain't all on 10 hog. The play is fucked up. Simple as that. That is criminal. The first half of four May United were lackluster. But somehow, like I said, when Chelsea made that mistake, Chelsea started off bright. When Chelsea made that mistake and Ganacho scored, he gave May United momentum. That woke them up. It's criminal. You had Ineos in the crowd, 10 half thinking he's got the three points away. Started bringing on Rashford and McTominay, et cetera, et cetera. And from then, he just, and he's been on guys for fresh legs. And you end up losing 4-3. People will say the second penalty was harsh. Could say, but at the end of the day, it looked like he slipped. And if he slipped and it touches the guy, must make contact. You're stopping him from running. He falls. The Anthony penalty, you don't know what Anthony's thinking. But for me, that was a soft one. There should be more made of that. But the reality is, it was in Manchester United's hands. Fuck everything else. I'm sorry, that is criminal. That was my team. I'll be raging. I'll be for some raging moments. I've never seen nothing like it. All my life, I thought the Liverpool 4 threes was the best 4 3 ever. Not that I, that I would have enjoyed it back then, but as a neutral, you think that's the best. But this one here, you know, as a neutral, that was a, it's just end to end. Poor moments, great moments. As a neutral, that's what I love to see. I was entertained. But if you're a main, and even a Chelsea fan, don't know what you was thinking at that time. And the sort of scenes, it was wild. That is some real mid table battle going on. Because Man United could slip down. We used to say they're going to stay up the sixth place, like Newcastle, Kokachi, and West Ham, Brighton. Yeah, it's crazy. That game was wild. Love to hear your thoughts. If you're a Man United fan, I beg you. You, uh, that, you, you must feel sick. Truly dread, I'm out. Peace.